welcome to all in this video we will be talking about how to convert a mower machine to a mealy machine and vice versa mealy machine to mower machine so if you want to know what exactly these uh, two machines are you could just uh, look at the previous uh, clip right they basically finite automata but are used to convert uh, some input string to an output string okay and uh, they find applications in uh, NLP for transducers, okay, for designing transducers. Now, coming to Moore machine to Mealy machine, uh, so uh, like I said, if you want an introduction to Moore and Mealy, please refer to the previous video clip. So, a Moore machine has an output associated with its state, right. And this is an example of a Moore machine. Every output emits a uh, output. And a Mealy machine, you know, doesn't have an output associated with its state, but it has an output transition, meaning for a, in a particular input state on a particular input symbol, you are have going to have an output. Okay although you don't have an output for each state right so the conversion from a more machine to a mealy machine is quite trivial so if you look at this uh, mealy more machine uh, after coming to q1 it emits an output one right so uh, in order to make it a mealy machine you just say okay on input z on in state q naught on input uh, uh, one it emits an output one okay and q one on input zero it emits an output one right so basically for each state instead of having the zero coming out of the state you would you would move it uh, to the transitions to, in, to the input transitions to all the input transitions mm -hmm. so this one would go to here so it would become bar one and this would become bar one okay and then uh, for uh, q naught there are no input transitions for q3 there are one two three four four input transitions so for each of them this bar 0 would go to each of these transitions so from here you would have 0 bar 0 1 bar 0 and then you would have 0 bar 0 and 1 bar 0 okay and for q2 there are two input transitions one this one and the other one uh, self transition self loop so the zero would go here so you would have one bar zero and zero bar zero so that's what you get and this is your uh, final uh, mealy machine so conversion to more machine from more machine to mealy machine is uh, fairly straightforward now coming to a uh, mealy machine to more machine this is a bit more tricky here you have an example of a mealy machine which you want to convert to a more machine now uh, the issue and i mentioned this in the previous uh, video clip right is that uh, f okay for a single uh, input state for example q1 you would have two outputs okay which means you cannot uh, do the reverse what you did in the previous case like i said okay here uh, why not you know in this example if you want to convert this mealy machine back to a more machine right what would you do uh, see all the uh, input transitions have the same output so you could directly remove this uh, one and put it inside the state and here you could directly remove the output and put it inside the state and here you could directly remove the output and put it inside the state and you would get the more machine right but here that's not the case it's a bit tricky because you see q1 it has output 0 as well as output 1 and q2 has output 1 as well as output 0 
So the trick here is you output, uh, you duplicate all these states which have more than uh, uh, two corresponding outputs, right? So in this case, Q3 has the same uh, output for all the incoming transitions, right? So you have, uh, this is the two incoming transitions, both have output one and Q0 has also has the same output for all incoming transitions. So these are the two incoming transitions, both have an output one. So Q0 and Q3 are not duplicated, whereas Q1, Q2, which have different uh, corresponding outputs for uh, different transitions, now they will be duplicated. So you would have one state corresponding to an output of zero and one state corresponding to an output of uh, one. Similarly, Q2 would have one state corresponding to an output of zero and one state corresponding to an output of one. Okay. And if there are more than two outputs, you could have, you could uh, replicate them two or more times, right? But in this example, there are only two different outputs. So I only replicate them twice. Okay. What next? So I said that uh, Q0 and uh, Q3 are not duplicated, whereas uh, Q1 and Q2 are duplicated. Okay, so uh, so this would be Q11, comma uh, one. You know the the output will be the same as the second index in the subscript, right? So this one and that one would be the same, right? So they would be equal. So if this is a one, that would be a one, and if this is a zero, that would be a zero. And same here, this is a 1, that is a 1, this is a 0, that is a 0. Meaning that uh, this actually stands for the output. Okay. Okay. And now coming to the transitions, uh, as for Q0 and Q3, because uh, they have only output 1, you would just put a 1 here. There's, there's no duplication and, you know, uh, the output is uh, the, the single output that we have. And what about the transitions? The incoming uh, for the states that are not duplicated, the incoming transitions will remain the same. So you have one bar one here, and you have only one here. You will in, you will remove the output symbol, right? Because that has gone inside the state. Similarly, here I'm sorry, this is not an output tra incoming transition. This is another incoming transition, and again output is one. So you just remove the one and put the zero here. And similarly for Q3, uh, the 1 comes here and the 0 comes here and the 0 and 1 they come here and then uh, you just remove the outputs from these transitions, right? Okay. Uh, but only thing is that because you are duplicating Q1, now you will have, uh, trans. you need to duplicate the tr incoming transitions to Q3 because uh, so this would be 0 1 and this would be 0 1 as well so the if you think about the reason why you duplicate the output transitions for these states right the reason is that uh, see q1 could uh, you could come to q1 based on this transition having output 0 as well as based on this transition having output 1 and from that you could have transitions to q3 based on 0 or 1 right so potentially you could be in any of these two states corresponding to output 0, 1 and from there you could have transitions to Q3 on 0, 1. Therefore, the output transitions of the duplicated states also need to be duplicated. Okay. So similarly for Q2, also you would duplicate the transitions. So see here, uh, this 0, 1 would need to be duplicated, but because uh, this corresponds to an output of 1, it would go only to Q11. So both these will go to Q11 on input 0. Okay. And uh, this is also uh, an output transition, but it's a loop. But because the output is 1, so both Q20 uh, and Q21 would go, go to Q21 on input 1 right because the output is one and you got to go to the state with the corresponds to output one that is this state okay and uh, yes so yeah 
So the deal with uh, the replicated states like uh, Q1 and Q2 is you replicate the state for each output and incoming transitions choose the destination state based on the output, right? So like for example here, you would choose uh, Q111 not Q10 because for input 0 you get an output of 1, okay? And then for outgoing transitions for the replicated states, you replicate for each state. Like in the case of this one and uh, this one as well, you replicate the outgoing transitions, right? So that's uh, that completes the conversion of a Mealy machine to more machine. And uh, given that you can convert uh, more machine to Mealy machine and Mealy machine to more machine, uh, it seems that uh, they are, uh, you know, the two are equivalent. Okay, but uh, you know there are uh, varying notations of uh, in the literature regarding Mealy machine and more machine, and for that reason, all for all those notations, it cannot be said that Mealy machines and more machines are equivalent. But in this case, for uh, the notation we are using, uh, you can consider that Mealy machine and more machine are equivalent. Uh, thank you for watching.